Hi everyone. I am so excited to be back today doing, um, as you can see, another MDF base. Uh, I've done other trays. This is going to be a tray. Um, just like I did in my video 27, 28, 29, I've been asked to do another tray. Um, it took me a little while to get my color scheme to make my choice because I really wasn't sure. And because it has to, I know that the contour of this tray in particular is going to be some type of maple. So I had to plan the color scheme to go with the maple as it's going to age, which has a tendency to yellow a little bit. So um, I knew I wanted to use some kind of red, which is what I have here, a really, really deep red. Um, so the colors I'll be using today, I'm going to be using by Liquitex um, a Lazarin Crimson Hue. Um, I also have a new product here that I'm excited to try. It's a, a golden iridescent gold. I've never tried that one, so I'm super excited. It looks so beautiful. Um, my pink will be Tutti Frutti mixed with, mixed with some uh, Artist Loft White. I also have Artist Loft White on its own. Um, I've mixed a bit of black art from Artist Loft. I'm not sure if I'm going to use it or not, so we'll see. I added a Floetrol to everything as well as silicone. And uh, that's about it. So, working on my MDF base. Today I want to do um, some kind of ribbon pour, which is going to be new for me. I, I haven't done that in a while, and I have no intention of blowing it, but we'll see where it brings us. And I'm going to be uh, working with a white background, leaving some white negative space. So, I'm excited to try that. Hope you guys enjoy watching. Hope it turns out nice.
This painting was uh, quite the process for me. I started off wanting to make ribbons and um, there was a lot of things I liked, but there were more things I didn't like. So overall, I was not pleased with the outcome. So I decided to take advantage of that and try dipping for the first time because I didn't want to waste too much paint. So I was happy to be able to try that. And I think that that painting came out actually really pretty. And then I decided, well, that's not really a nice look. So let's try some swiping. And I wasn't really able to do anything with that. So I decided to just scrap it and start all over again from scratch. So before I did that, I just, I took a little break, try and regroup myself, and then I started all over. Um, I was trying to do some finer ribbons, going for some more wispy lines. Um, and I'm happy with the outcome, with the overall outcome. It has uh, a lot more flow, more movement, and it's really a new style for me that I was exploring. So I hope you guys enjoyed watching the video. If you did, please click on the like button and subscribe to my channel. We'll see you next time. Bye.